Omnisend tutorial how to use Omnisend for email marketing. Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I will be giving you a tutorial on Omnisend, how to create email marketing campaigns, how to grow your online business and much more. So let's get into it. First of all, you're going to go to Omnisend.com and you will land on this website right here. Now, Omnisend is an email marketing platform that allows you to create SMS and email marketing campaigns for your online business. If you have an online store already, if you have a website, then you can integrate Omnisend very easily. So once you get to this platform here, you can actually get started for free. Click on the start free trial and you can sign up using your email address or using your Google account. After the initial sign up or sign in to your Omnisend, this is where you will land. Now you can see this is our main dashboard and this is actually a beginner's dashboard. Um, so I'm getting all of these options. Uh, in our main dashboard, we'll be getting goals, overview and live view. Then we have our campaigns here. So within our campaigns, we have email campaigns and SMS campaigns that we can create. This is where we will be working for email marketing. Then we also have the automation option available within Omnisend that allows us to send automated and personalized messages based on customer behavior and shopping references. We can also create signer forms, pop-ups and more with Omnisend. We have the audience where we will be able to create the contact list and much more and then we have the reports. So the first thing that you need to do is in order to get started with the campaign, you can actually go to the audience section and then you're going to go to the contact list and here you will add the contact. So I'm going to click on add contact. We have a lot of different options available. I can add a single contact here or we can actually paste a contact detail. We can import a file. We can import from MailChimp or Clevio. So for me, I'll be adding a single contact for now. So we'll click on add. Okay, so we have to enter an email address and a phone number. So I'm going to quickly do that. Let's say that I'm creating this contact, which is Ben. So I'll just enter the email address. And then we also have a phone number here. We can add different tags and more fields into a contact right here on Omnisend. Once you have added the details, you're going to click on add subscriber and this contact will be created. And this way we have our own subscriber list. Now we'll simply go to the campaign section here and let's create an email marketing campaign. Click on create and it will take you to choose campaign type. We have AI generated promotional email. Now this is actually a new option that we get on Omnisend and we can actually create an email within five minutes using an AI. Then we have our regular email that we can create one time email, a email with AB split testing, SMS and push notification. So you can see with Omnisend, we have a lot of different options available. So let's go with this one, which is a regular email, because as a beginner, this is the one that you will be creating. All right. So we have to enter our subject line here. For me, I'm just going to go with the word test for now. And we can even boost the campaign with Omnisend. Sender's name. So you will enter your name or any team member's name here. Sender's email address. You can choose an email address here pre-header and campaign. So these are optional. If you want to add this, you can. Language, we will be going with English. If you want to actually auto post email campaign to your Facebook page so we can directly actually connect Facebook to Omnisend, this is one of the options that, that makes Omnisend stand out. A lot of integrations and a lot of different options that allow us to create an email marketing campaign and boost it um, immediately. And this is one of the features that makes Omnisend easy now we're going to click on next step choose a template here we will choose from different templates available you can see we have weekly newsletters we have announcements uh, showcased bestsellers discount code coming soon product highlight uh, we have on different events you can see mother's day uh, campaigns black friday campaigns and more for us let's actually create a, an announcement uh, email so you're going to preview or you can click on use. We're going to click on use template. With the template, it becomes easier for us to customize. Okay, so here we have our main editor to edit any email right here. At this side of the screen, we have our library where we have quick add that will allow me to add different items such as text, buttons, image, video, logo, menu, discounts and more. And then we have saved items. We have saved layouts, pre-headers, header, Hero image, email body, product listing, image gallery, and then we have our footer. 
so uh, this is our first thing which is the logo image so if you do not have a logo image then i'm gonna actually get rid of this now we have something like this all right so at the top we have this menu kind of thing which is a layout i'm also gonna get rid of this because i do not have any menu at the top i'll just be going with a banner image here or a text section so i'm going to go to quick um add and we're going to go with the text drag and drop it here at the top so once we do that it will be added so we will enter our text now and let's say that my text is new product because this is an announcement email that we're creating we're going to select the text and now you can see we have uh, you know all of the tools given here and we always have an ai assistant for us so here i will be actually making it centered aligned and then the size the size is actually pretty small so i'll actually make it bigger and we'll keep it to 30 here okay now i'm going to change the color of the text and make it white okay and then okay so this is what it looks like now what i'll do is i'll actually make this image go up uh, from here let's actually do this you can get rid of all of the different elements that you do not want within a template so i have added this and now we have to customize this image we have this hero image um, within the template so we'll actually replace it whenever you select an element on omniscient uh, you'll be able to customize it from here at the side of the screen and if you want to add something then you'll just go to quick add and you'll be able to do so so the image is already added here now we will click on replace and it will allow me to upload an image from my computer so this is the image that i have added and if i want to you know make it a little bigger then i can do that from here but i think this size is actually okay so we can actually place it a little bit down i'm going to go to quick add and we can add a line or a space so i'm going to go to quick add here and i'm going to drag and drop a space here at the top here okay so now there's a line and it kind of like divides this section which looks better after that we have the products listed here make your monday count so i'm going to change from here and i'm going to go with like a simple text check out our products right and this is where we'll again uh, change the image this is a simple image that that has been uploaded here and this is a simple text then we have the buttons now you can see we can add a link to a button uh, this uh, says shop now i can actually uh, click and maybe like customize the text here maybe buy now we can go with that so let's go with buy now and now i can add a link so for that i'm gonna actually quickly go to my shopify store and i'm gonna copy and paste the link to add to the buttons here like so perfect now you can see a link has been added after that we have this best seller thing uh, within the template again we have an image here so we can click on replace and i'll be able to replace the image so i'm going to get rid of this and we're going to go to the quick add and we can add a menu we can add an image discount product listing and more so here i'm going to again go with the product listing we can uh, drag and drop here and you can see this is the section that we already added this is what i wanted to show you this is how we add the product listing so we have already done that again click on uh, quick add if you want to add a menu if you want to add a video everything can be added from here in my case i'm going to add a line and we're going to add a button so drag and drop a button here a button will be added and then we can customize it completely at the bottom we have socials again go to quick add and you can add the socials and then select a social from here we have a lot of different options available we have selected facebook instagram twitter tiktok i'm also gonna select shopify and i'm actually gonna delete twitter from here and we're gonna add pinterest okay uh, sorry it's spotify so we're gonna actually get rid of spotify from here we're gonna go with the website so you can see these are all the icons and now i can add all of the links this is our main footer you can also add the footer from here you can add a product listing hero image header and pre-header from this side once your template is customized and you have created your email you feel like it's ready it's looking good click on send test email or click on finish editing and you can schedule this email for later or you can send it now it's actually really easy the next step is going to be selecting the subscriber list 
and we will be selecting the customer or a subscriber that we just created. So here we have the subscriber we have selected. Click on next step. And this step is sending email. For now, I will not be sending this email because this is a test email, so we can go back. But now you know how to create an email marketing campaign with OmniSend. It's a really easy to use, high quality, and with a lot of different tools platform, which allows you to create high engaging email marketing campaigns. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up or leave a comment down below, turn on bell notification and subscribe to YouTube channel.